Kim, Amber, Savannah, Vivian, Ha, welcome today. We are going to cook. We have our little chef ladies over here and they are gonna whip us up a little bean dip, Amber. Yes, yeah, Savannah's gonna use the stove for the first time. I'm so very excited. Very, I'm very scared. exciting, very yeah. exciting. It's gonna be good, it's gonna be good, I promise. I'm scared I don't burn myself. Well, no. don't touch the hot pan. First we're gonna use turkey meat. I like turkey meat because it's less fat, not as much grease, but also we're gonna put something on it so we don't have to taste it. <laughs> okay, when you're cooking and people splatter grease all over their house and stuff, that's because the fire's up too high. It's not a cooking tip, but it is kind of fun. Oh, there we go, a little piece of paper. It's a bonus round. <laughs> We're gonna take our spatula. Love that word spatula. Don't you love spatula. that word spatula? Like a spatula? Mm -hmm. It has to all be broken up. Well, not all be broken up. Let's not go crazy. Good job. Good job. Good job. Okay, so if you have the tire down here, then the bottom part's gonna cook first, right? We're just gonna let it sit for a minute and cook. Vivian, can you get two thirds cup water, please? The we'll just take the Las Vegas water. <laughs> it's gonna cook out. We're living on the edge. Oh. Wow, you guys are so fancy. Yeah. Fancy around here. We do like how fancy. You know, when I flip things, I like to go like under it fast. People always say, How do I do eggs well? That's why you go under and you go really fast. Like, is that easier? Magnificent. Yes, mm. she did so well. Yay, Anna. Yes. All right, yes. Vivian's turn. Vivian, can you please add two thirds cup water? Yes. Okay. I be aware of the camera. Very good. Perfect. Okay, here, add this. Okay, okay we're Anna. adding one pack sure of taco it. seasoning. You gotta mix as she as Slowly, she, slowly. Slowly, slowly, yeah. You can just plop it all in there. Look how good they're doing. Now that you have learned how to do this, this could be used in a burrito, this could be used in a nacho, this could be used in anything taco. that has taco meat. And then just swishy, 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 swishy. It says bring it to a boil and simmer for a second, but we have, so that's what we'll do. You <laughs> <laughs> follow directions. It's recommended. Well, you, follow, up. you follow the ingredients and directions. We well, have to open up a can of refried beans. I chose fat free because why not? Then a can of green chilies. This is a little bigger. It calls for a four ounce can, but this is a seven ounce can. You can make it however you want. It's gonna taste delicious anyway you make it. Anyway, Ms. Vanna, would you mind opening these cans for me? Maybe She's just recently started making her own tuna fish sandwiches. So she's Ooh. very familiar with the can opener. And how old is Vanna, your daughter? She's seven. And, and my niece just had a birthday, and she's 10. I remember when I was a little girl, my grandpa told me when I turned 10, I, was, I would turn into a little boy. And I always had that worry, even though I knew he was joking. <laughs> so I was really scared on my 10th birthday that it was going to happen, but it didn't, thank goodness. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> you are definitely all girls. <laughs> thank you, Miss Vanna. We are going to use a 9 by 13 pan. We are going to preheat the oven to 400. How do we preheat an oven? <laughs> Well, we come over here. What do we want to do? We want to bake it. Bake so push the button that says bake. Okay, Vivian, could you please type in 400? And then start. Start. So salsa. And this is a little bit more than I need too, so I just kind of do it till it's a little sloppy. It calls for eight ounces of cheese, but sometimes I like cheesier. <laughs> First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put these beans in there, okay? Beans. So this is gonna be our first layer. Smush it like it's kind of like Play-Doh or- Mashed potatoes. Mashed potato, mashed potato. Do you remember the Wiggles? No. She did not watch Oh, I'm dating watch myself, video. aren't I? Yeah. They had a song that went, mashed potato. Hot potato, hot potato. Hot potato, hot potato. Hot potato, hot potato. 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 Potato, potato, potato. Fruit salad. Yummy, yummy. Fruit salad. Yes! 
Yes. You know the wiggles. I do know the wiggles. Then how come you can ignore me so well? It's kind of troubling. <laughs> 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 she can block out, block out the noise. If she can block out me, then she is more of a woman than I am. It is a talent. It is a talent. That's looking pretty good, good ladies. Good, 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 good job. Good job. job. We are going to put our delicious taco meat that Vanna and Vivian made so wonderfully. Can mom handle this possible mess? No. I'm gonna be behind you. Okay, close your eyes, Amber. Okay. Just kind of. Throw it around, yeah, just throw it around. Just throw it around. If it falls on the floor, it's okay. No, 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 we'll leave no, no, it. Don't to we'll pick it up to tomorrow or no, something. Tomorrow? It's really what? Oh, oh my word. How do you got know. so <laughs> whose house do you think you're at? <laughs> I'm not think, throwing ground beef anything anywhere. I think that a lot of people miss out on the fun experience because they're worried about keeping it clean. That's what I think, Miss Tate. Um, I don't think it's fun if it's messy, so. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Do you think fun is messy? No. Sometimes. You're supposed to say yes, you're seven. <laughs> you're supposed like to clean too. You're supposed to say everything's fun. <laughs> you eat taco meat, don't you? Mm. She's a vegetarian too? No. She just doesn't eat meat a lot. Oh. I'm scared of her. Yeah. Like chicken nuggets, if that counts. Ah, uh, it counts. It counts. <laughs> Okay, Miss Clean Freak, could you please handle this? Yes. Thank you. Here. What would we do without her? We are going to take a spoon. And push it. And we are, no, we're going to take and do like you did with the meat. Just kind of sprinkle it around. Make sure it goes it spicy? everywhere. It's medium. No, it's not. I like spicy, but not too spicy. I love, I love spicy. <laughs> you love spicy? Yeah. Oh, good. Next, we're going to put on salsa. We're gonna take it and we're gonna oh. do you like oh. that over here. all over the top. Slowly, slowly, easily, gently, not violently. <laughs> like I like. <laughs> right? Aggressively. Aggressive, I like that word. I like intense. You like intense? Oh, that's a good word too. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. yeah. That's beautiful. Okay, now what would be the only thing that could top this and make it more beautiful? Cheese. Bingo! Yeah. Okay, girlies, we're just gonna... Oh! Oh! Hold on, very gently. Oh. Can you do that? I'm gonna help you, okay? Because the whole thing's gonna go. I'm just not careful. Oh! It's like that. <laughs> oh! Got a little Laugh with Kim. I have a great meatloaf recipe. Makes three big honkins. You can use the turkey meat too because you're drowning that out with flavor. Got it, got it. Because turkey meat kind of tastes like. I think you're using turkey meat better. Right. You right. cover it with cheese. Because you don't have that good old fashioned artery clogging grease. 400 for 20 minutes. Mm, we have to wait for 20 minutes. Oh my goodness, girls. Look at the deliciousness that oh, has been made. Oh my goodness. Yes. I day. Cheesy, oh. ooey gooey yumminess. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Yeah. Dippity, dippity, doo da. Dippity, doo da. Dippity, doo da. Zip, oh, that's zippity. Yeah. That's <laughs> Not zippity. Right Sorry. Amber can't have any because there's no, meat in it. That's okay. I tried to explain to her that meat eaters don't think the same as vegetarians. And that's probably true. Meat eaters start with meat and work around it. Okay, girls, what do you think? It's hot. Hot. Hot? Hot. Hot but good. And delicious. Hot. My opinion is hot. Hot and super califragilistic. Super califragilistic. Expialidocious. Even though the sound of it is something quite atrocious. Oh, it's delicious. It was wonderful. Yes. Well, Thank you. what an easy thing to make. It wasn't bad. Your kids can make it with you. Always good to teach your kids to cook. Hey, how about uh, that button right there? See that big red button? Yes, please subscribe. It's free. And if you're watching us on Facebook, please like and share. Also, don't forget about Laugh with Cam over on my other YouTube channel. Just me being like, boink. I do sometimes. <laughs> Join us next time. That was a lot of fun. But even if cooking isn't your jam, that's okay, no problem. Find something else to do with your kids or anyone else in your life that you love. 
Make sure they know that you love them every single day. The love that God shows us, be sure and show it to every single person you meet today. Up next, Amber's Closet. Ooh, salt and pepper. Yes, I love it. I love black and white with red. I just think it's so classy. It is. Yes. So this dress is so cute. I've worn it one time to my daughter's high school graduation, which was a big moment. But I didn't have this adorable belt, which you've seen with another dress. I have one in red and I have one in white. Of course. So, yes, I know I thought about the white one and even the red one, but I just thought the, the black would because of the red shoes. Mm. And it just looked a little bit more classy. It does look classy. Yes, and the sling back shoe, that's always really sexy. Mm -hmm. I like that look a lot. Yes. Yeah, so Very these I actually got on Amazon. I got a black pair and a red pair because I liked them so much. And they look really, really cute with jeans. So I wear them in jeans a lot. But with this dress, because it's a little bit more casual, but with the the double layer of ruffle on the bottom, it dresses it you know, up a little bit. Probably get like a twirly bottom too, huh? Oh yeah, like oh, yeah. twisted. Yeah, it's super cute. And it's actually made really well. And it's another sheen, shin, shin, whatever it's called. S-H-E-I-N, it is worth it. I'm telling you, they have any size you can imagine. And every dress is so cute. I have like a hundred of them. And if you want a review, I will give you a review because I probably own it. So this is a really well-made dress. The fabric is super soft. It does wrinkle, but I've only had to iron it one time which is a bonus once you iron it. it. It stays pretty nice, unless you throw your clothes on the floor and we do that. Not to break. So, but it's really cute. Mm -hmm. So join us next time for another fabulous dress out of Amber's closet.